Climate change is real. When you watch the oceans, it's really scary. Given seven and a half billion people on the planet going to 11, this is going to put major pressure on resources. And in particular, it's also going to put pressure on farming and, and food. We are here to do something about this. We have ambitious renewable energy goals. We have ambitious carbon neutrality goals. And by 2045, we'll be a 100% renewable energy state and we'll be a fully carbon neutral state. And the only way to do that is with many facilities like these. We are embarking upon an organics recycling renaissance. This is a very significant facility. It is the largest food waste digester in North America. When fully built, processing a thousand tons a day of organics, both food waste and biosolids from wastewater treatment plants, and producing both renewable electricity to power the facility and export renewable electricity onto the grid, as well as export renewable natural gas to fuel vehicles through the natural gas grid. The natural gas that this facility produces is actually sequestering carbon, meaning equivalent to planting trees. We can't reverse climate change without carbon negative projects like the one right here. Bioenergy is going to save the world. We're in an era now where looking at organics recycling is really exciting, so this is a great opportunity to see this plant being in the early stages of construction. So the state needs many of these facilities, and the success of these facilities and others are paramount to serve as a catalyst for the state to build the roughly 200 facilities that it needs to achieve the organics diversion goals. So this is a very significant moment in California state history because being the largest organics recycling facility food waste digester in North America, obviously in the state, I will prove that our organics diversion goals are possible, they're real, and they will happen in, in the timelines that we expect. And this facility must succeed to be an example to the rest of the state and the rest of the country and